Hey guys, I'm back with more Technic. This is going to be a quick little, not really quick, but it's not going to be much of a uh, machinery type deal. It's going to be like easy stuff this time. It is kind of complicated. I have all my stuff here just so it's ready to go and I can show you real quick. So we're going to be making the macerator, which the macerator can turn, let's say you have two, or one tin. You put it in the macerator and it creates it into two tin ore. And it's it's really helpful. It makes you so you don't have to go back into the stupid mines. Mine's like freaking miles away. But yeah, before I show you that though, I'm going to be showing you what I've been doing around here. And I think there was a horse over there. There was. This is like my 15th time trying to start this video and I can't. Oh, I lost the horse. But I did actually get some horses. And the way you can get those horses is by finding some apples. So let's, I want to go find the other horse. Okay, uh, well, actually, uh, I don't really need another horse. I have two already. Ooh, is that a bird? Is that, oh, it's a crook. Get it. <laughs> come here, come here. Okay, okay, sorry, 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 sorry. So here are my two horses. I have Geraldo and App. And they are pretty freaking awesome. <laughs> they actually spawn, oh, hello. They actually spawn right next to my house and it, it's pretty sweet. So Geraldo was my first one. And let's just get on a little ride here. So the way you can, like I said, get these guys is you obviously need a horse saddle. And then you also need a apple. And I can show you how to make a horse saddle right here. Horse. Oh, what the heck? You can make horse armor. Ooh, we should do that later. So oh, the way you can make a horse saddle is by getting some leather and iron ingots. Very simple, or just get a simple saddle and then put ironing under it. So, pretty awesome. I found this one right next to my house, and there's a little goat. So, it makes everything a little bit quicker to go around, and there's a ton of sharks over there. So, we're just going to put Geraldo back on Geraldo. But yeah, it's a little bit quicker, and not as much of a hassle to run the places. The way you get off of them, which I didn't know for like the first oh, ah, done. Oh, I gave him one of my apples. Get back in there. Come on, Geraldo. He's a happy guy. He's a happy guy. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, <laughs> dude. Singing horsey. Dude, he likes that song. Okay, anyways. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, what else I did was um, I made this little walkway because it looked really crappy. I mean, it still does look pretty crappy, but these are my rubber tree farm trees. And they're growing pretty nicely. I mean, there's still a ton of sap I can get. Um... Yeah, it looks, I just need to make it a little bit nicer looking over there. But I also have made my storage room, which is down there. I haven't transferred everything yet because that takes such a long time. But I've made it look pretty clean. I mean, I love how the glass is like not even there, it seems like. So yeah, that's going to be my, that's going to be my storage room. And then those are my horses. And oh, I'm going to be showing you guys a few pictures, maybe in the end of the video. Uh of stuff I found at night which is really creepy. It was like a zombie horse with a zombie on top of it and it was like scary look. <laughs> I like walk outside, I look to my right and he's right there and he starts charging me so I run back in, of course. But um I also found a snake too, which I haven't been finding much of. A ton of oh, oh there's one out there too. Nice. There's I found a green one earlier. So maybe I don't have to I'll just show the horsey at some point of this video. Look at this guy. Oh, don't. Kitty. Kit, oh, kitty. No, kitty. Kitty, you're not gonna win. You're not gonna win, kitty. Oh, I just saved that cat. That deserves a like. Come on, guys. I just saved a cat. Even though cats are pretty evil. Um, <laughs> just kidding. I, I love cats. Anyways, what did they drop? Orange snake egg. So, we can probably learn more. Oh, I forgot to show you my little water place. So, they actually get water here, too. It's pretty fancy, huh? I know. Anyways, let's get back to what we were trying to do here. So, the macerator. Macerator, macerator. You go in, Okay, if you want to make this a good setup, you're going to want to get some redstone pistons, which I'll be showing you afterwards. So, let's first of all get... Where did I put them? Crap, did I? 
What did I do? <laughs> oh, great. Alright, so the way you make the macerator is you get an electric circuit, which is built this way. You get three copper cables, and you put them all around. Redstone, and then you get a machine block, which is just. Oh, what the? Oh, whoa, whoa. I want a machine block. Okay, that does not show the right machine block. Um, I don't know why I did that. That was weird. But machine block is just uh, nine refined iron all the way around, making a normal furnace. And then you also need some flint going three across, and then cobblestone. Pretty sure. Yeah. Okay, let's just make it. Just put that there, put that there. there. I don't know why it all got mixed up. Oh, I did it anyways. Nice. That's, that's I'm just so good at this, I guess. So you're going to put this little fella. So I also know my textures aren't working over here. I don't know why. I've been trying to fix it. I honestly, because I saw comments on my last video saying, you need to update or patch it, and I can't find how to do that because I'm, I don't know. I just, I've been going to the sites I got it from, and there's nothing about it. So it's just weird. So what you want to do next is obviously connect to the generator. Voila. And now it's losing power. So you're going to need a lot of coal here. This is why coal is very much needed in the beginning of Tekkit, but after a while you will never need it, I promise you. Um, oh yeah, I also put some gravel in. Wait, why isn't it working? I put gravel in there. That is odd. Anyways, uh, so that's the macerator. Let me show you what it does real quick. Let's just grab some, I don't know. Uh, let's just grab some tin, because that's what I was going to put there in the first place. You're gonna put the tin right in there, and oh wait, the macerator I think is what turns it in. Ah, oh, oops, whatever. All right, so mass. So then he turns it into voila, tin or yeah, tin two tin dust. That's what you want. Now this is where the redstone engine comes in. So you're gonna put want to put this fellow right here. And you're also going to need to get some pipes, so let me show you real quick, hopefully I have wood on me, there you go. I don't want to make this look ugly. Alright, so the way you make a redstone piston is you get a piston, and if you don't know how to make that, you get cobblestone on each side with redstone, and yeah. It's, it's something I've never known how to do until now. <laughs> so you get, wait, redstone piston to re-jog my memory here. Right, you need the wooden, okay, okay, okay. So to make the wooden gears, you need to put two of these guys on each, get two of them, bam bam, get the piston, and you put some glass on top of it with some cobble stuff. Oh, oh wait, no, it's wood, I need wood with some wood. <laughs> There's the redstone engine. Beautiful. Yeah, so it's not going to look like a redstone engine in my hand, but uh, it's it doesn't matter. I mean, it looks like one right there. You'll also need a little redstone torch. So let's go get that. I got it there. Oh, I don't know why that's in there, but anyways. Like a redstone torch just to keep it on. I mean, you can break it if you want it off. I mean, it, it really doesn't matter if it stays on. It won't bust or break or any sort of that. Oh, shoot. Um, crap. I was not very smart with my choice of positioning. But, whatever. Put that guy right there. Let's get some of my wood back. Um, uh. I guess I'm just going to keep it like that because it's obviously there. Okay, so that makes that guy go. And now you need to make some wooden pipes. Oops. Other way around. Wooden pipes. This is what sucks it out of the machine. So as you can... Oh, shoot. <laughs> as you can see, it does that. Now, there's also two other popular pipes. 
which are the stone and cobble pipes. Oops. I have cobble with me. Do I have oh, I have stone. Okay. Perfect. Let's put the stone on both sides. Cobble on both sides. And now, what you can do with these guys is if you have a whole bunch of pipes going everywhere and so you don't want them to mix, you can just simply, see, they don't, they don't touch each other, they can go around each other, they don't connect and any sort, it's very awesome. So now what you want to first of all make just, just so it doesn't, uh, get all crazy, is you want to make a iron furnace. Now what you need obviously is iron, which is... No, my iron. I swear I had iron here. I am missing supplies. Oh, here you are. I knew I knew I had it. Seriously, I also made chairs, but they weren't working. I don't know why. But uh, just simply make a. There you go. Iron furnace. I'm gonna put this guy right next to him. You're gonna put that guy right there. Get some coal. And then this guy is going to cook the bars. Thing. Yeah, you're gonna cook them, right? Right. Oh, it's not going in the right spot. Oh, it's because I'm putting it on the side. Alright, right, right, right. I messed up. Alright, so. Can't put this guy here because it will not work. Need to put that there. Then you're going to make it go up. Oh, <laughs> it's going to be kind of messy for my little style of... But I can make it a little... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. There we go. Now it'll work. Remember, you gotta put that stuff on top. Perfect. Very nice. So now that'll cook that. We're gonna put another pipe into the chest, which I will make in a second. But I need to make another redstone engine. So, be right back. And voila. Ooh, what's that? <laughs> wow, I just built this and I get instantly. <laughs> distracted by that. Fantastic. So now I made it so it will create the bars. The bars are being pumped into the box and now it will be sorted in there. So it's actually a pretty awesome deal. The only problem is the generator is pretty crappy. So we're gonna be we're gonna need to make a bat box which can store um the power. Now how to make a bat box. Let me quickly show you because it's a lot easier to show you instead of just saying it at the moment. Put that, that, that there. Oh, cut. There. You're going to need three batteries. Okay. This is going to be semi-simple. If I can remember how to make batteries. <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure I know how to make the batteries. So, let's just quickly do this. So you're going to need some tin, which I am obviously getting a lot of. You're going to need some copper cable, and yeah, okay. Let's get some of this, so let's get like one, two, so, uh, so it's, I need 12, okay, I'm just going to take it off. These there, back on top, and red right some middle. Perfect, I did it, nice. All right, I mean, I knew I did it. Okay, so we need three of these guys. There we go, perfect, now you got, oh, shoot, 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 shoot. There we go, three batteries, perfect. Let's just quickly check on that. Then wood, perfect, all right. So you're gonna put wood all, ah, oh, I'm running out of wood. As you can tell, Technic requires you to have a lot of stuff on you for a lot of different things. It's just non-stop going back and forth and grabbing more stuff. Which is pretty awesome because it makes everything just as exciting to build. Put that right there. Gonna put the wires right there. And three batteries. And there you go, bat box. 
That box stores the energy that the generator will give it, and then it can release it when these machines need it. So we're going to put the bat box right over here. Very nice. Now we need to connect the bat box with the generator. So let's just get a little bit of underground work here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that guy fell. <sighs> oh! He killed himself. Okay, very nice. Uh, I mean, that's not that nice. So let's just get it to give the power from under here. Very messy work, very messy work, I know. But definitely work it. worth it, not worth it. Uh, Alright, so. Connect, oh. Connect this guy. Down here. Ah, oh, I ran out of frick. Alright, I'm gonna get this all set up and I'll show you guys in a second. Alright, I got it all hooked up, and now, once you give it a little power with the generator, which is just by connecting it through here, and putting it up into the bat box, it will give it power. It has 40,000 power level that will be stored in this, or that is possibly stored in this. It is now hooked up to the extractor and the master, so as you can see, the red is filling up them. I can put um, gravel. There we go. And then it will give me gravel, it will be pumped into this, and this will still use coal just for now. And yeah, it's a pretty good system. I mean, you can see it's going to... Oh wait, I don't have that in the right spot. One quick second. Alright, so I need to make a wrench. I'll be showing you how to make a wrench. Soon enough, I just am running out of time right now. It does require copper dust and I think tin dust? Tin or steel dust? I'll show that later. Don't worry, don't worry, I'll show it. But as you can see, now it's working. You need to change the little dot that was there, the output into, um, into where the wires are coming out of, so then I can, oh, obviously output that so what the heck just happened <laughs> uh that wasn't supposed to happen i don't i think i just broke it but it's not supposed to break because i have a wrench who cares i don't need that anymore <laughs> oh great so let's just cover this up make it look a little bit nicer around here and also now you can see the power does go down semi quickly but i mean it's only being used when it needs to be used so Oh, that doesn't make sense. I don't know why I'm putting that in there. And yeah, pretty sweet. So, I should do actually a lot more than I was planning to. I just kind of got carried away, but that's a pretty good setup. Also, I was thinking about making... Ooh, pretty. Uh, making something with these trees, because they're actually really cool looking. I can easily make like a tree house sort of deal with them, connect them, and get like solar panels or something. I was going to think about doing that, but just give me suggestions, and that cat just killed another cat. It's fantastic. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed, and remember to leave a like and comment. See you guys.